If you haven't been drawing for a while, let's try and get unstuck for a bit. Hey, welcome back. This is Satria, C-E-T-R-I-Y-A. And actually, I have to welcome myself back. It has been quite a bit. And it's not that I haven't been drawing, but I have been very busy. But maybe you've been kind of stuck, actually, lately of what to draw, what else to draw. So I thought I'd share just a quick and simple method to get you warmed up and back into drawing. One of the biggest thing or the first thing that you might be running into is that fear of the white page. So I decided for this one, while I was going through my old sketchbook, trying to like reignite the flame that got me to drawing, I picked one of my old drawings and just for fun, decided to redraw her again. You know, sometimes when you're doing all of these drawings or art, you have so many self-doubts of whether you are improving. And don't get me wrong, I could see the mistakes even in this new drawing of mine. But I have to say that I have gotten better and even flowing in and just doing the quick sketch and inking quickly, just just keeping it loose and without pressure definitely helped me to build my self-confidence towards actually going in and just putting down the mark. You know, you've been drawing for a while and today you were just not inspired. So that's the second thing redrawing something that you've had before it definitely helps to just keep the mind loose and just warm it up and just going back and drawing something that you have drawn already without having to overthink too much about art inspiration not that you know you could just go ahead and draw something new but it's probably a better comparison to see where you have gone with your skills in terms of your art but more so perhaps you haven't been drawing for even longer than you thought you have. And sometimes kind of like riding a bicycle, you just kind of look very awkward or feel very awkward when you're getting back to it. And it takes a while to kind of get back to it. You know, it takes a while for you to remember or get back into those physical motions, um, just letting your hand tell you where to go and things like that. So definitely just keep it simple, you know, find a picture that you like or you think you can improve or just have fun and just try redrawing that. Another way you can do it is, of course, doing fan art. I haven't done fan art in a while now, but I do recall that one of my previous kind of like, I guess, art breaks or art blocks or just art burnout, whatnot, I just went ahead and just did some quick um, sketch fan arts of series that I find fun and inspirational or just character drawings that I may not even know too much about the character, but I like their outfits or their art style. And I went ahead with that. Another thing that you can do is, of course, mess around with new testing materials. In my previous live, I went in and tested out quite a bit of my ink stuff, making sure that they're okay. Same thing with my uh, Crayola markers. I definitely need to test out other things, but it's been a while since I've used color pencil and you could kind of tell that it's been a while. Not only is the paper a bit too smooth for such a thing, but um, I'm just not used to working with non-opaque type of you know, materials and mediums. But I guess that little bit of challenge definitely added to me just kind of like breaking in and just, you know, just putting stuff on paper and not really caring too much. Even in this image, I personally think her lips is quite, quite, quite juicy, but maybe you like it. Anyhow, let me know down in the comments below or even, you know, a quick message or whatnot, what you thought of in trying to get yourself back into the groove of drawing to get over the fear of the white page, as many have said. Of course, it helps when the material is cheap, at least for me, cheap papers and cheap materials. Pretty much, I don't care if I destroy them or whatnot. So that might be, you know, my final bonus tip of that. But yeah, let me know down in the comments below what your thoughts were and tell me how this image turned out. Do you think I've actually gotten better at this imagery? Um, I will say that though I appreciate it very much and I'm glad that I got down to you know, drawing in my sketchbook because I've been working digital for so long. I definitely do have more to improve. So hopefully I actually keep to a routine of drawing on a regular basis. Let me know if you like this video. Feel free to thumbs up, like, subscribe, and all that jazz. All the best. Until next time.